So now I'm going to move in the final piece, uh, isocircle two, which I'm going to hang on this rod here. Um, and um, so I'm going to move it in, and then I'm going to um, move it so it's in the proper orientation that it's going to go in. Uh, I find that moving it otherwise is kind of hard. So I'm going to go to, um, in the same thing, I could go here, right? But it's already, already set for me. So I can just save a step, rotate, and then it's rotation. And I'm gonna say I'd like to rotate on that axis. And I've met, fiddled with this enough to notice that I'm pretty sure I remember, yes. It already does it for me, shows me a preview. And I say, okay. All right, well, that is pretty messed up. But luckily, we can join these two figures, and I can get that to hang on there. I'm going to use um, something called a, um, a between two faces joint. So I'm going to go here to join, and then I'm going to go to um, my first component. That's the one I want to move. So between two faces. Uh, this plane and this plane in the back. I don't have to move it around to find that. It basically goes between it. This part's a little tricky. Um, I want to find this center point between these two holes at the holes. So I kind of have to hover in there and I can find it. You can see this one comes up. That won't work. It's going to be quite offset if that one was there. So I click on that and then it says it's selected. Super out and then the next one is also between two faces and I'm going to click it here and click it here and then that is pretty obvious ba boom and then I'm going to say okay you can you can have movement and all sorts of things you can add to this but I'm trying to keep it very simple for just the very basics so that's how you would do this assembly from different sheets over here that were pre-created and, um, and then after this you could do a lot of different things. Um, you can do this all in one of these sheets but it tends to get complex and hard to understand at times and most I think modern um, assemblies are done like I just showed you. Um, with quite a bit more complexity, complexity, and then also <clears throat> an understanding of how they all tie together. It's not what we're trying to get at right here, um, but this is just the, the simple way of making a design from um, a bunch of sheets.